Hello friends, welcome to Education Shelf Live. I am Dr. Rudhi Agarwal and I am here with the next part of the series that is GK for AIMS. So, today we will cover the 10th part. So, we have covered 9 parts already, so if you haven't seen the parts yet, then go to the channel, go to the channel, go to the playlist, go to the playlist, go to the playlist, go to the GK for AIMS name playlist, go to the 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 playlist. So first question is which country has banned the use of Indian currency notes of rupees 2000, rupees 500 and rupees 200 denomination. So one such country is which has banned India's currency notes of 200, 500 and 2000 and banned them. So that is Nepal. Then next is Dash has launched a new e-commerce platform Reweave.in for handloom weavers under its project Reweave, part of its philanthropic initiative. So philanthropic means what happens when you help someone without any support, we call it philanthropy. So who has launched a new e-commerce platform which is called Reweave.in Handloom Weavers for their own project which is called Project Reweave. So that is Microsoft India. Then next is who is the chief guest of the 15th Pravasi Bharatiya Divas Convention. So the 15th Pravasi Bharatiya Divas Convention was the chief guest of the Pravind Jugnaut. And the guest of honor was Kamaljeet Singh Bakshi. So both are different. Chief guest is different. Guest of honor is different. So we have to keep the name. Then next question is India ranks dash on the Global Talent Competitive Index. So Global Talent Competitive Index is India's number? 80th. Now who has become the fastest Indian bowler to claim 100 ODI wickets? So who is the fastest Indian bowler who has taken 100 ODI wickets in one day international? That is Mohammed Sami. Then which state government has declared Pakke Paga Hornbill Festival as the state festival? So which state government has declared Pakke Paga Hornbill Festival, or PPHF, in the form of state festival, is Arnachal Pradesh. So what does this mean? It means that Pakke Tiger Reserve is in Arnachal Pradesh. So that's the basis of it. Now 10 years after 26-11, the Indian Navy commenced the largest coastal defense exercise of the Indian coast. What is the name of the exercise? So this is an important question because it's been 10 years since 2011. So after that, Indian Navy has started the largest coastal defense exercise on the Indian coast. And what is the exercise name? Sea Vigil. Okay. Next question is, who among the following has been named the Interim Finance Minister and Interim Minister of Corporate Affairs? So what is it? Arun Jaitli Ji was a little bit sick for a few times. He had a kidney and some problems. So he was hospitalized. He had an operation. So he is a finance minister. So who is the place for a few days? Interim means a few days. Time being, which we call it. So who is the place for Interim Finance Minister? Piyush Goyal. The next is Prime Minister Narendra Modi launched the Pravasi Tirth Darshan Yojana under which a group of Indian diaspora will be taken on a government-sponsored tour of religious places in India dash a year. So Prime Minister Narendra Modi launched a project which is called Pravasi Tirth Darshan Yojana. What will happen in this under? Indian diaspora, i.e. Indian people, will take them on a government-sponsored tour in religious places in the year two times. So it will take them on two times, whatever they want to go to the country. Then next is, Dash government organized the second edition of Global Investor Summit in Dash. So, which government has organized the second edition of Global Investor Summit in Dash? And where has it organized? So, Tamil Nadu government has organized it in Chennai. Then, second World Integrated Medicine Forum 2019 was held in. So, where was the World Integrated Medicine Forum? In Goa. Then, Next is National Girl Child Day is celebrated in India on. So National Girl Child Day जो है इंडिया में कब मनाया जाता है 24th January को और इसका थीम क्या रहा था 2019 के लिए empowering girls for a brighter tomorrow. तो girls को empower करना जिससे उनका कल जो है वो एक अच्छा बन सके. Now on 3rd December 2018, the United Nations General Assembly adopted with consensus a resolution proclaiming Dash as International Day of Education. तो 3rd December 2000 18 को जो हमारा यूनाइटेड नेशन जनरल असेंबली है उसने कंसेंसस मतलब सबकी सहमति से तो सबकी सहमति से उसने किस दिन को इंटरनेशनल डे ऑफ एजुकेशन मनाया वही जो हमारे यहाँ नेशनल गर्ल चाइल्ड डे मनाया जाता है दैट इज 24 जनवरी को Then Sultan Abdullah Sultan Ahmad Shah has been elected as Dash new king by the members of country's royal families. So now the kingship is running in some countries. So in Malaysia, Sultan Abdullah Sultan Ahmad Shah has been made a king of them. Next question is, Russell Baker has passed away. He was a noted. So Russell Baker's death was a writer. 
नेशनल वोटर्स डे इज सेलिब्रेटेड एवरी ईयर ऑन तो इंडिया में नेशनल वोटर्स डे कब मनाया जाता है ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ जनवरी को और इस साल की थीम क्या रही है नो वोटर टू बी लेफ्ट बिहाइंड कोई भी मतदाता पीछे ना छूटे Then the Dash government has decided to form a state tiger protection force to save the big cat population in the state. तो ये जो tiger, leopards ये जो होते हैं इनको big cat बोला जाता है. तो state tiger protection force किस state government ने बनाई है? Telangana ने. जिससे इनकी population को बचाया जा सके. Then next is which country has declared sugarcane juice as the national drink of the country? तो गन्ने का juice जो होता है, उसको national drink of the country किस country ने declare किया है? Pakistan ने. Then, which state government has floated a Pravasi dividend pension scheme to provide regular pension to the non-resident people of the state? So, which government has provided a Pravasi dividend pension scheme to provide regular pension to the non-resident people of the state? So, that is Kerala. Okay, I'll tell you one thing. The sugarcane juice that you have to drink with your cold drink or your cold drink is also very good. It's also natural and you get so much sugar and it's so much energy. That's why you need to drink this juice in the warm days. Besides, cold drinks and cold drinks, it's very good for warm days. So, in warm days, this juice is less than 2 or 2 times a week or 2 times a week. You need to drink it very well because it's very good for you. And it's natural that you have to drink it in your body. So, you need to drink it too. So, you need to drink it too. 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 ठीक है डिहाइड्रेशन नहीं होता है नेक्स्ट इज विच स्टेट हैज अनाउंस दी लॉन्च ऑफ युवा स्वाभिमान योजना फॉर यूथ्स फ्रॉम द इकोनॉमिकली वीकर सेक्शंस इन अर्बन एरियाज तो किस स्टेट ने एक योजना अनाउंस की है जिसका नाम है युवा स्वाभिमान योजना तो यूथ के लिए है ये जो इकोनॉमिकली वीकर सेक्शन से आते हैं अर्बन एरियाज के उनके लिए तो वो है मध्य प्रदेश एम ने की है ये योजना देन द ऑक्सफोर्ड डिक्शनरीज अनाउंस डैश एज द हिंदी वर्ड ऑफ द ईयर तो क्या है हर साल एक हिंदी वर्ड जो है उसको अनाउंस किया जाता है एज हिंदी वर्ड ऑफ द ईयर तो इस साल किसको अनाउंस किया गया है नारी शक्ति ऑक्सफोर्ड डिक्शनरी ने उसमें अब इंक्लूडेड रहेगा ये वर्ड नेक्स्ट इज इंडिया फास्टेस्ट इंडिजिनस ट्रेन विच विल रन फ्रॉम डेली टू वाराणसी हैज बीन नेम्ड एस तो इंडिया की सबसे तेज चलने वाली इंडिजिनस ट्रेन जो दिल्ली से वाराणसी चलेगी उसको क्या नाम दिया गया है वंदे भारत एक्सप्रेस Then Michael Legrand has passed away aged 86. He was a well known. So Michael Legrand जो है उनकी बिड़ेत हो गई और वो एक बहुत बड़े कंपोजर थे. Then Assam government has conferred the Republican Day Journalism Award 2019 to veteran journalists. So Assam government ने Republic Day Journalism Award जो है 2019 का वो किसको दिया है? दीरेंद्र नाथ चक्रबोर्ती को. Now according to Cisco, India ranks dash in GDPR readiness index. So Cisco के according इंडिया जो है उसकी रैंक क्या रही है जीडीपीआर रेडीनेस इंडेक्स में वो रही है सिक्स तो जीडीपीआर का फुल फॉर्म क्या है जीडीपीआर है जनरल डेटा प्रोटेक्शन रेगुलेशन ये रेगुलेशन इट इज अ रेगुलेशन इन ईयू लॉ ऑन डेटा प्रोटेक्शन एंड प्रिवेसी फॉर ऑल इंडिविजुअल सिटीजन ऑफ द यूरोपियन यूनियन और सिस्को क्या है सिस्को का नाम लिया गया है सैन फ्रांसिस्को से उसके सिटी नेम से लिया गया इसलिए उसको सिस्को बोला गया ठीक है देन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज Who among the following won the Australian Open 2019 men's singles tennis title? So, Australian Open 2019 men's singles tennis title kisko mila hai? Novak Djokovic ko. And women's singles tennis title kisko mila hai? Naomi Osaka ko. So, these two names are important to keep. Then, who among the following won Dehatsu Indonesia Masters 2019 women's singles badminton title? So, that is our Saina Nehwal ko. And men's singles badminton title kisko mila hai? Anders and Townsend ko. तो ध्यान रखना है इंडोनेशियन मास्टर्स जो है 2019 का वो जीता है फीमेल कैटेगरी में साइना नेहवाल ने ठीक है देन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज द 25th फिफ्थ एनुअल स्क्रीन एक्टर्स गिल्ड अवार्ड टुक प्लेस इन तो ये वाला एक्टर्स गिल्ड अवार्ड जो है वो कहाँ पे हुए थे लॉस एंजलिस में Then name the former defense minister who passed away in Delhi at the age of 88. So, 88 की एज में कौन से हमारे डिफेंस मिनिस्टर जो है उनकी डेथ हो गई जो पहले थे अभी नहीं So, वो है जॉर्ज फर्नांडिस देन 5.1 किलोमीटर लॉन्ग केबल स्टेड अतल सेतु ऑन द मांडोवी रिवर इन तो गोवा तो एक 5.1 किलोमीटर का लंबा जो है अटल सेतु बनाया गया है मांडोवी रिवर पे गोवा में Then who has become the first Hindu woman to have been appointed as a civil judge in Pakistan after passing an examination for induction of judicial officers? So, who is the first Hindu woman who has been appointed as a civil judge in Pakistan? They have passed an examination for judicial officers and they have become a civil judge. So, that is Suman Kumari. 
Then next is which country has replaced Japan as the world's second largest steel producing country according to World Steel Association. So World Steel Association के मुताबिक world की कौन सी country ने Japan को दूसरे number से हटा के और वो खुद जो है second largest steel producing country बन गई है तो वो है India. ठीक है पहले हमारी जो Japan था वो second number पे था उसके बाद India ने उसको जो है हटा दिया और अब India जो है वो second number पे आ गया है तो first number पे कौन सी country है first number पे है China okay तो first number पे China है second number पे India है third number पे Japan चला गया है fourth पे USA है और fifth पे South Korea है तो ये top five countries हैं जो largest steel producing countries की range में आती हैं now which of the following country has received the award of excellence for best in show at the New York Times Travel Show 2019 which is the largest travel show in North America तो किस country को award of excellence मिला है best in show के लिए तो वो मिला है India को again which country is the largest producer of crude steel accounting for more than 51% of production तो अभी मैंने बताया आपको कौन सी है China and in which state the Adivasi Mela 2019 was inaugurated recently? So, which state the Adivasi Mela was inaugurated in which state? That is Odisha. Then, next is, which country has continued to be the largest source of FDI in India? That is 19.7%, followed by US and UK according to RBI. So, RBI according to which country is the largest source of foreign direct investment in India? 19.7% comes from there, then the US comes from there, then the UK comes from there. So, the largest share of which country is Mauritius. Next is the Civil Aviation Ministry launched the country's first geographical indication store at Dabolim International Airport in. So, Civil Aviation Ministry ने country का पहला GI store जो है, वो Dabolim International Airport पे launch किया है और ये airport कहाँ पे है? Goa में. Then which country has been ranked in Bloomberg's 2019 list of most innovative countries in the world? 2019 Bloomberg Innovation Index for the first time ever. So 2019 के Bloomberg Innovation Index में किस country को पहली बार rank मिली है? वो है हमारी इंडिया. Then Transparency International has released the Global Corruption Index 2018. तो Transparency International एक organization है जिसने Global Corruption Index जो है 2018 का वो release किया है. India rose by three points to dash in the list of 180 countries in the world with a score of 41. तो 180 countries में से India का number आया है 78. तीन number ऊपर चढ़ी है country और score रहा है India का 41. ठीक है? So these were the important questions for today's session जो आप लोगों को ध्यान रखने हैं सारे के सारे हमने बहुत सारे questions cover कर लिए हैं और अभी हमें और भी बहुत सारे questions cover करने हैं so मैं hope करती हूँ कि आपको सारे questions और उनके answers और उनके explanation समझ में आ गए होंगे कोई भी problem हो तो comment section में आप मुझसे पूछ सकते हो ठीक है so like का button दबा देना share करना अपने friends के साथ channel को subscribe कर देना और subscribe करने के बाद जो bell icon है उसे दबा देना जिससे आप लोगों को नोटिफिकेशन मिल जाएगा जैसे वीडियो प्रीमियर होने वाला होगा आप लोग ट्विटर फेसबुक इंस्टाग्राम ग्रेड अप इन चारों जगह पे मुझे फॉलो कर सकते हो इन सब के लिंक डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स में दिए हुए हैं ओके सो आज के लिए बस इतना ही दैट्स ऑल फॉर टुडे गाइस थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग है